Hey guys, your inner chakras, welcome back to the channel guys. If you are new, you are welcome. All right guys, we're going with Relationship Therapy 101. Again, don't forget to flip these energies. It could be with you, about you, or about your person and another person. Um, if you are new here, welcome. Welcome to the site of YouTube. All right, what's going on, guys? Relationship 101. Relationship therapy. Letting go. Somebody is letting go, guys, and accepting what happened with forgiveness in their heart. So someone is letting go of a situation with forgiveness in their heart. They forgive you. They forgive themselves, right? Whatever that is. Uh, toxic families. Uh, this is familial energy. Familial energy affects this relationship negatively. So the family is tox toxic. The family is in you all's relationship. And they probably can't get past it. So your, your family, somebody's family has too much to say, too involved, too opinionated, too, 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 too. too. And it shouldn't be that way. Yes, it's nice to get advice from families, but sometimes you gotta separate them from your relationship. Like you gotta handle that on your own. Take their advice, but don't be like what my sister said, and my cousin said, and my brother said, and my uncle said, and my mama said, and my daddy said. If your mama, daddy, brother, sisters, and cousin aren't paying the bills with that person or whatever, doesn't matter. Um, so families are toxic. It could be even more than that. It could be more than opinions. You know, it could be more than that. All right, guys, let's see what's going on. They're letting go because of toxic families. Accountability. They are taking ownership of one's own actions without resentment, blame, or justification. So whatever they did to this relationship to create the problems, they're taking ownership of whatever they did without any resentment, without any blame, like blaming you or any justification. They're not trying to justify um, you. They're not trying to justify what they did. They're just owning up to what happened. And that's why they're letting go and accepting what happened with forgiveness in their heart. So it just didn't work out. But I believe the biggest problem is possibly family, whoever's family is toxic. Their family could be toxic, you know, and their family could have caused too much negativity in you all's relationship or your family could have. Or they could be letting go of someone else whose family is way too involved. So feel free to flip it. Get in where you fit in. Put some kipper on here and see what's going on. Holy Spirit. This is a main male. So the main person that's letting go could be a man. Main male energy here. So he could be the one that's letting go of the relationship. Then we have a wealthy man. What the hell is that? Is this a same-sex relationship? Either that or this main man could be letting go because maybe you're dating a wealthy man. Maybe your family is encouraging this. Maybe your family knows about this and encouraging you to go to this wealthy man. But there's a main male and a wealthy man. I don't know if it's the same man. Maybe the main man is wealthy. You know what I mean? Like, it could be that as well. Or your family could be encouraging you to go to the wealthy man. What's going on here? Unexpected income. Taking accountability and ownership of one's own action, resentment, blame, or justification. So maybe they feel that you have a chance to be with a wealthy man. And maybe your family is encouraging this. And telling you to go be with the wealthy man. Maybe your family's too involved, you know. Um, for some of you. 
Or the family could be encouraging you. God, leave him, girl. You better go be with that wealthy man. I don't know. Holy Spirit, clarify this. This main male here. King of Wands in reverse. And he's healed from all of this. So he is the one that's walking away. He's healing from all of it. He's just letting go. He's not saying too much. Spirit, clarify this wealthy man. Let's slide this over. Clarify the wealthy man. Who are you? Lot of pentacles in reverse. This man is in his ego. And then we have the empress. So this could be who you're trying to go to. You're the empress. Uh, family could be encouraging you to go to be with this wealthy man. Ooh, child. Spirit, clarify this unexpected income. Wow. Family could be encouraging you to go and be with this wealthy man. And they're over it. Seven of Pentacles in reverse. Maybe they feel like they couldn't give you what you wanted. Uh, they couldn't build with you what they wanted. Uh, nothing came of it or whatever. Or they definitely couldn't build as fast as that wealthy man. And they're just frustrated. Maybe they feel like they can't compete. And then family could be encouraging this person. Could be encouraging you to go and be with this wealthy man. And they're just over it. Spirit, clarify this toxic family. Judgment. Yep, you, 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 your family has opinions about this connection. Your family could be judging you, judging the situation, having something to say, telling you to move forward. Definitely very judgmental family. And five of cups. So there's some regret here. I don't know. They could be regretting the fact that your family got involved. They could have regrets about dealing with you because of the situation. The family could have regrets for getting involved as well. Holy Spirit, what's going on here? This main male here is definitely up in his head about what he's going to do, trying to figure it all out. The wealthy man is standing in his spot. He's standing in his strength like he knows who he is. Little child. Ace of Swords. They don't quite have clarity on what they're going to do, though. They don't quite have clarity on you and this wealthy man. I think they're just letting it go. Yeah, they're healing their heart. They feel like you're moving on to a wealthy man. And that the family is encouraging you to. That kind of hurts, right? This is the devil. It's almost like the devil is here. They're offering you a choice. So one is offering you love and the other one is offering you money. Can you see that? One is offering you ice cream because that's all they can afford. And then the other one is offering you money. So this man here could be up in his head. He's kind of like, well, what the hell, you know? Like, I can't compete. If all I can give you is this ice cream cone, then this other man can give you money. Holy Spirit. His energy is definitely unbalanced, I guess, when it comes to this wealthy man. It looks like he's just going to walk away. He's, he's going to tell you his truth about how he truly feels. Uh, Knight of Wands, he, he knows that you have passion. He's healing because you have passion for someone else. Or someone else has passion for you. You could be coming in as the Queen of Pentacles as well. And he's moving on. This man is just, he's just going to move on. He's just going to let go. He's moving on. Uh, he definitely feels like you have options. And 
and he doesn't want to go back to the past or how things were or he's he's definitely not going to stay this man is definitely moving on um the world is over as he wants seen it things are going to end he's going to end things this is just too many burdens for him he's not going to put his, himself in competition with a wealthy man right i guess you're choosing money over love i don't know or maybe you love the wealthy man too some people don't believe that, but that's possible as well. The tower is in reverse. He may feel like you know this wealthy man. Family knows this wealthy man. This is somebody. You're trying to fix something with a wealthy man. And your family is encouraging it. Ten of Pentacles. I guess he feels like you're going to try to build with this wealthy man. Spirit, clarify the Six of Cups in reverse. The Magician. I guess you're standing in your power, manifesting what you want. You're hopeful. He feels like you're hopeful for this connection. Yeah, he's just going to let it go because he can't compete with this wealthy man. He can't compete with your family encouraging you to go and be with this wealthy man. Like, he, he can't compete. Holy Spirit, you're coming in as the Queen of Pentacles, so you already have money as well. Clarify this devil. Nine of Swords in reverse. He's not up in his head anymore. He's just going to let it go with the lovers in reverse. Clarify this Queen of Pentacles. Clarify the Queen of Pentacles. Ace of Pentacles. He feels like you have other opportunities in front of you. He's just going to bow out gracefully. Yeah, that's the death card. He feels like you have other opportunities. He's just going to bow out with the death card. He feels like he can't even compete with this wealthy man. It's too many burdens for him. Ten of Wands. Yeah, Knight of Cups. The, this wealthy man is probably coming in offering you all this love. He feels like he can't compete. Family is encouraging it. He feels like your life will probably be more balanced with this wealthy man or maybe that's how you feel and that's what he sees. Spirit, clarify this Ten of Pentacles. Four of Pentacles. He's not giving any more energy to it. He's, I guess he's just standing up for himself as the Emperor Energy, making decisions for himself. He's just going to move on. Ooh, Spirit. This is a yucky reading. Kind of sad. Holy Spirit, anything else with this main male? Prosperity begins. Financial material changes for you. Yeah, yeah he feels like your life is going to change with this person. And this is conflict and defeat. He feels defeated. He feels defeated. He feels like there's no competition. Like he, he can't even, he can't compete with your family. He can't compete with the wealthy man. He loves you, but I guess apparently that's not enough. So he's just going to let it go. That was the first card out. He does feel like your family is toxic, I guess, for giving you the advice to move on. Um, he also feels like you know this man as well. So guys, I don't know. I kind of feel bad for the man. Because his heart is broken. And he probably feels like he's not enough. But they make women feel like that all the time. So, <laughs> it is what it is, guys. And good luck with that. Thanks for watching. Please like, share, and subscribe. Peace.